hey y'all welcome back to my channel and welcome to my what i got my family for christmas video so i do just want to let you all know in the video you will hear me mention my mom and you will hear me mention maddie which is madeline and that is my partner and those are the only two people that i got gifts for as far as my what i would consider my immediate family yeah. this video is vlog style i guess you would call it it's not me in front of the camera showing you each item because as i went i like to wrap my gifts and you know put them under the tree so it is all of my hands in the video me just showing you things from a hands point of view if you know what i'm saying so if that is not the kind of video that you like then i will catch you in the next upload if you don't mind that kind of thing then i hope you will stick around before we get into it i do have a few shout outs that i want to give i did stop by my p.o box and y'all blessed me with some items and i wanted to show my appreciation i received a ton of beautiful cards thank you all so much i appreciate it more than you know i got a lot of christmas cards this year and you all um some of you may have already received yours back from me if not i did go ahead and stick them stick them in the mail hopefully you will get them before christmas if not i'm positive you will probably get them the day after christmas so thank you so much to miss nancy b i love this card so much look at the stockings and the tree by the fireplace and thank you so much to miss sue i love your card as well thank you so much to s young that is how she signed the card Thank you so much for this beautiful card with the red truck. And then also thank you so much from Miss Debbie. I loved your card so much. Thank you. And thank you again to Miss Debbie Epperly. I received your card as well. Thank you. And then I received a card from, let's see here, Charity. Recognize that name. You sent me tons of cards before. Thank you so much for this card. This actually matches my um, my kitchen Christmas decor. I have a lot of like Noel stuff. I got like some uh, placemats and some um, what they call floor mats or floor rugs for the kitchen, and they say Noel on them, and they're in red and green, like the traditional Christmas colors. So I love that. Thank you so much for this card. And then also thank you to Miss Tasha. I love this card so much. It's a season's greetings. And then thank you so much to Miss Candace. I loved your card as well. Also received a lovely package from Miss Erica and her family. Thank you so much. I love all these goodies, especially this crossword puzzle book. I'm usually not a big person on crossword puzzles, but I think these kind of things keep your mind sharp. So I really appreciate that. She also sent me this beautiful card from her and her family. And then she mentioned in the card that she sent some wooden pieces. She sent this tag. Uh, this pack of tags as well but she mentioned specifically these wooden pieces and that you know she knows that i am crafty and maybe i could do something with these so these should be fun to do some type of diy with last but not least thank you so much to remy crafting she sent me something else y'all she sent me a card about a week or so ago and then she mentioned in this note i hope she doesn't mind that i read it she says hey wendy i couldn't resist giving you these two little gifts they both reminded me of you merry christmas remy so thank you so much remy you know you didn't have to actually send me anything but i definitely appreciate it she sent me a little lila figurine from the Lilo and Stitch movie, which I love. I don't have really anything with Leo, Lilo on it. And then she also sent me a pair of these Disney Stitch socks or crew socks, which I love. So thank you so much, Remy. Y'all stay tuned on my channel because the day after Christmas on December the 26th, I'll be doing my annual What I Got for Christmas video. Did it every year that I've been on YouTube and I love continuing that tradition. Hey y'all, so I know the lighting is kind of crazy and I am going to be whispering for the most part. I'll try to want to come and show you all some of the stocking stuffers and gifts that I got for my family. So what I'm first going to show you is this little basket that I've made up for Maddie's grandmother. Maddie is my partner and I um, we always get her grandmother's stuff for Christmas because her grandmother always looks out for us. So y'all have probably already seen me put together a whole basket video by now. This video probably will not go up until Christmas day. Uh, just because I don't want to spoil it in case anybody watches my videos. But I have this little Dollar Tree basket here. It says Merry Christmas. Inside I, inside I got her some of these socks. These are the Snuggadoo 2 Super Soft Socks. That little dog on there. Got her some of these Rudolph snack, the Rudolph snack mix. 
some of the Cutex foot cream. Also got her, where is it at? She loves this thing right here. Uh, the LA Colors Nail Polish Remover. She's really into painting her nails, so she really loves this. I got her some for, uh, when was it Mother's Day? I made her a nice little basket and I got her quite a few of these. I think about two or three. That isn't quite a few, but I got her a couple of these and she really loved them. And I'm getting her probably a couple more of those actually now that I think about it. I put in here this mug that says Making Spirits Bright. I like it because it somewhat matches the font of that. And then I have right here this um, red chuck cup. Y'all have to excuse my desk because it is full of stuff right now. I also have in here this Russell Stover's um, Solid Milk Chocolate Bar. It's two ounces. I thought she'd really love it because that cute little dog on there. And then I got her this kitten planner for her purse. This cute little card. It says Cozy Holiday Wishes. Sending warm wishes your way for the happiest holidays. I'm still not done getting stuff for her though. Um, I need to find, I think, two more things in particular. So I'll update this video as I go. I got her the Lion King live action DVD. Uh, we went to see it in the theaters, but I thought that she would really enjoy it. So I got her this. And then this is just the bag for me to put everything in. So that's what I got Maddie's grandmother. Well, for Maddie, these are just some of her stocking stuffers. So I got her this red chuck cup as well. She already kind of seen me pick up a couple of these. And she was like, oh, those are nice. And I was like, well, let me go ahead and give her one since so she said that she liked it. So I got Maddie some of these little wet and wild um, compact, um, not compact, eyeshadow palette things. Um, just some, you know, a little eyeshadow to go with what she already has, but she already has plenty, but I know that she'll appreciate to mix and match some of these little colors. So that's just a little something to go on her stocking. And then I also got her, um, this Bliss Text, uh, lip balm kit. You get the deep renewal, the global blend, and the ultra rich hydration. I have some of the Russell Stover chocolates. And then this Russell Stover Solid Milk Chocolate Bar. Russell Stover has a really good candy on. And also the Snack Mix, the Rudolph Snack Mix. Her and her grandmother both have one. Because I know that her grandmother, you know, she'll mention it. And Maddie will be like, dang, I want one. Um, I got her some of this Fun Dip. I got it because Maddie loves cherry flavored stuff. So I know that she would like that. And then I also got her some of the Queen Anne uh, chocolate covered cherries, the brand name, which is a good deal to find. So I got her this, I saw this at Target, and I thought this was so cool. Cherry cotton candy, again, she loves cherry. So I think she'll like this. This has a lot of sugar in it though. So hopefully she doesn't eat all of this in the first week. But honey, she is a grown woman, so she can do as she pleases, but she definitely needs to pace herself with that stuff. And then, I got her these socks. I thought she would really like these. They're nice and long. She can probably wear them as like knee socks or something because these are the men's size. And it's uh, uh, the gingerbread man that says, oh snap. I thought she would think those are cute. And I got her the sweet tart candy canes and then one of these Mickey candy canes. I just know whenever I have children, they're gonna be super spoiled with all kinds of goodies because I'm buying these little stocking stuffers like I'm buying for kids and these are, you know, grown ass people, but that's just how I am. I just love buying little stuff like that, you know. We don't buy too many of these things throughout the year, so it's nice to, you know, treat ourselves to little stuff like that and have stuff to snack on for, you know, the next, the following weeks after Christmas. It's nice to have little stuff to snack on. I also got Maddie this um, Revlon three pack of the um, HD lip color. She loves the Revlon HD lip colors. Thought this was a good deal to get three of these in here, y'all. Especially seeing as how this one right here is her favorite color, I know. I don't know if she'll like this dark one, to be honest. Um, she's very fair skin, so I don't know if she'll like that. But she'll like these two for sure. This one might even be too bright for her. 
I might end up getting one of these, but I, I still thought this was a good deal, y'all, because if you go in the store and you think about how much this really is for one of these, this is fairly pricey. And this says the travel exclusive, but this is the size of the real one. I mean, it really is. So I got that. And then I got her, um, I always get her hairbrushes for Christmas because it seems like the only way that she'll get a new one. The hairbrush that she has right now is just worn out. It, it's really on its last leg. So I like to try and get these like heavy duty brushes during the Christmas time. This time I got her two of them. So I got her this, um, what is this, Swiss, Swiss coat brush. It's like a heavy duty paddle brush. And then I also got her um, a chest may brush which i thought was really good i mean trust me is a uh, well-known brand name and these are heavy duty especially this one right here they're really heavy duty i also got her this conair hair dryer uh, when we moved i don't know what happened to hers but she mentioned that she wanted to have a hair dryer again she's been air drying her hair for years but she mentioned that you know when she was blowing drying her hair it had a little bit more body to it so I just got this smaller one because she doesn't need a, you know, like a heavy duty one. So I grabbed that. For Maddie, I also got her this Carhartt toboggan. I have to be really quiet so she doesn't hear me. And um, I ordered this off of the website and she really likes the Carhartt brand. Um, her birthday's in January, so I'm probably just gonna get her another actual Carhartt coat for her birthday. I may get it for Christmas. I don't know yet, y'all. It's still November when I'm filming this part of the video. So I still don't know. I might get her um, that for Christmas as well. I got her this Carhartt hat right here. It's like a bucket type of hat. I think that is so cute. And it's like really her style. Sometimes she likes to wear hats. I love hats too. Um, I think I would like more of that toboggan though, but this is like more of her style. I hope she likes the color though. I probably should have got a tan one. I don't know if she'll like this color, but she she won't, you know. She's not an ungrateful person. She'll love it and accept it no matter what, but I think I should have got tan. I don't think it's too late for me to exchange it. And um, it looks like, huh, that's interesting. It has these little flaps right here, I noticed. Maybe this is so like your hair can get, not your hair, but your head in general can get air to it. So, I grabbed that. So now for my mom, I got her this shirt from Target. Um, I was looking through the clearance for myself to get myself something and I came across this for her. Um, it was $22.99, I got it for $11.48, but this is in a 2X, which I think is going to be a little too big for her. They didn't have it in a 1X, though, but she sometimes likes her stuff to fit very loosely. So I think that she may try and still wear this. Um, I guess either way, since it's on clearance, it's not like I can take it back. But she might can wear, um, like I said, wear it loosely or some kind of leggings underneath of it. But it's this gorgeous sweater, y'all. And I love the color of this. So I got my mom that. And I also got her the book Beloved um, by Toni Morrison, obviously. It's a classic. She's never read the book before. We've all seen the movie, of course. I haven't even read the book. They only have one copy of the book. So maybe after she finishes reading it, I can borrow it from her. Got her that. And then um, one of her stocking stuffers, this butterfly book, um, purse planners for her. Um, she loves the color blue, so I thought this blue butterfly would be a nice touch. Um, I got this card for her. It says it's the most wonderful time of the year. And I'll probably get her another card, like a mom Christmas type card. Do they make those, um, Christmas cards specifically for mom? I don't know why I'm asking y'all as if this is not going to be, it's not going to be up before then, but I'll figure it out. <laughs> um, I also got my mom some of these sterling silver earrings right here they're like hoop earrings they're totally her style the small hoops so I grabbed some of those for her I also got her a George Foreman grill I'll show y'all that before I wrap it up for one of her stocking stuffers I did get her some of this Russell Stover chocolate candy and then I got her some of this peanut brittle and then I got her some of these red hot candy canes so those are like stocking stuffer type of things and then 
see here is where I'm kind of torn because I have another Christmas card as well. I may give this to someone else, but I got her this Christmas card with this little red truck on it. But I don't know if I want to give that to her yet. We'll see. I'll figure it out. And um, at the end of this video, I'll, you know, let you all know for sure what I did. I'm also going to give my mom this. I'm going to paint it blue and put mother and daughter on there. Something like a quote about mothers and daughters. I'm going to try and paint it on there. And I'm going to use a white paint marker after I paint it, paint it blue. And then I'm going to put a picture of me and her in the center of that. So I thought, let me turn around like this so it looks better. I thought she would really like that. This would be a great gift for somebody. Um for like a baby shower or for their newborn, newborn's first Christmas, something like that, baby's first Christmas. And I got this from the Dollar Tree. And then I'm also going to give my mom this little tin. I'm gonna put some stuff in it for her though. That's why I was thinking that I would do the red truck card. I wasn't quite sure, um, cause I thought it would go good with this tin. But I don't know. I think I'm gonna put some hot cocoa mixes in here or um, get my mom some packets of decaf coffee or tea or something and put in here. I think she'll like that. This little tin, she loves little containers like this. So, I said everything that I have so far. This is everything that I have right now at this moment. It is still uh, mid-November filming this. So, uh, by the first or second week in December, I plan on being done with everything. I really want to get my mom a Fitbit for Christmas as well. I'm gonna try and get her that. And then for Maddie, I am going to try and get her either that coat or I'm going to get her, um, I want to find this thing, it's called a Nintendo Classic. Um, she really wanted that. She has the, uh, what is it, the PlayStation Classic. It's pretty much where they come out with the classic version of those old uh, game consoles or whatever. So I can't find that Nintendo Classic anywhere. I really don't want to order it online. Y'all know how I am about that kind of stuff, but I probably will. So we'll see what I do about that. And what else? It's a few more things that I want to get that I'm not thinking about right now, but I'll update y'all when I get that stuff. So I'm also giving my mom two of these uh, Bath and Body Works hand soaps. She loves these. So I'm giving her the Kitchen Lemon and the Crisp Morning Air. And then we are giving Maddie's grandmother the Kitchen Mandarin and the Kitchen Lemon. So here is the George Foreman Grill that I got for my mom. Um, she actually asked for this on her Christmas list. This was the only thing that she wanted. So I definitely made sure that I got it. I got her a nice big one. She had like a very, very teeny tiny one. Um, she got it when they very first came out. So she wanted an upgrade to that. So I got her this one. It says that it serves nine. Um, Advanced George Tough Non-Stick Coating. Exclusive Fat Removing Slope for Healthy Grilling. Uh, I guess that's a one inch hinge. Adjustable angle. Nested dishwasher, dish, nested dishwasher safe, removable drip tray, and vertical storage and cord wrap. So she can store this vertically. So uh, this one is exclusive to Walmart. You can go onto their website and they have all different types of George Foreman grills. They have very, very small ones that they don't have in Walmart. They have huge ones that they don't have in Walmart. But I got this one obviously from Walmart. <laughs> Um, yeah, this is the one that she wanted, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap that up. Alright y'all, so I'm back sharing some more Christmas presents. So for my mom, this was like an impulse purchase, but I know that she'll love it. I saw it and I could not resist. It was in the like Christmas movie section at Walmart. So it's a Tyler Perry double feature. It's a Medea Christmas the movie and the play. I don't think I've ever seen a Medea Christmas the play. So I'd be curious to see that one myself. So I got that from my mom. And then as a stocking stuffer, also got her some of this EOS Shea Butter Hand Cream. Um, it's in coconut, it has natural shea, and it's 2.5 fluid ounces. I got that from Walmart, like I said. Also got her some of these slippers. I usually always get her slippers every year. That's like a tradition. Um, and these are in the size 11, 12. They were $7.98. 
And I love that this says that they are eco-friendly and it says made with recycled bottles. So that's awesome. And I thought that she would really like the inside of them and the fact that the bottom of them are hard. I like to get her slippers uh, that have a hard bottom just in case if she accidentally uh, steps out the house to check her mail or something, they won't get messed up. And then I also got her this. Now this was another impulse purchase by me. Um, I have an idea of one more thing that I'm going to get her. I just have to order it. And it's something that I know that she wants because she was looking at mine. It's a Fitbit, not exactly like the Versa that I have, um, but one that would be more her speed. I'm getting her that I just have to order it right now. Uh, Fitbit has it on sale for $79. So it's a good deal for the kind of Fitbit that it is. But my mom also loves the Pioneer Woman. Um, last year for Christmas, she got a Pioneer Woman um, like pot set. And the year before that, she got the the other Pioneer Woman cookbook. It's got like a green um, casing on it. This one has red. So these are the new ones, the new Frontier. So I did get her this new Pioneer Woman cookbook to add to her collection. So that's everything that I got for my mom in this trip. And then for uh, Maddie's grandmother, I also got her a Pioneer Woman cookbook, but she loves her as well. She has some of her pots and she has, um, I think her, like her big crock pot that she makes. So she loves her. And then she also really loves um, this nail polish from Dollar General. She mentions it a lot, this Broadway brand. She always paints her nails and she always is telling me about this. Of course I get mine done, but if I were to stop getting them done, I would probably switch to this as well because it seems to stay on her nails a long time. So I got her this one. Um, does it say the color? Easter Annie. So she really likes uh, purple. She likes different shades of purple like me. So I got her that one. I got her this blue one. And this color is Mr. Right. Okay. So that's a nice color. And then this green one. These are kind of, you know, spring colors, but she'll wear them any time of the year. This one says Sand in Heaven. So those are for her. Um, I think I'm actually done with Maddie's grandmother. We're going to wait and find the Lilo and Stitch DVD um, and give it to her for her birthday because Maddie and her grandmother share the same birthday. So... Um, that's coming up in January anyway, so I'm going to try again and find the Lilo and Stitch DVD. I think I'm going to try and just buy it um, on Walmart online and just have them ship it to me versus trying to ship it to the store or that kind of thing. So let me show y'all the rest of the stuff that I got for Maddie. And I think I might be done with Maddie actually. Um, this start here, I'm trying not to say it too loud, but this particular flashlight I know that she will love. Um, for her job, she needs a very good flashlight. And um, this one right here, she's been looking at, I swear y'all, for at least like six months. It's a $30 flashlight, and I guess she just couldn't bring herself to pay that much for it at first. And then also, um, every time we would go in the store, they would be sold out of it. So, I finally found it. Um, actually, they had it in stock the last time we went to the store. And she didn't pick it up, but I took a picture of it because I know it's the one she wants. And I went ahead and grabbed it. So, um, it's a, well, y'all see it on the screen. I'm trying not to say it out loud. But it's a very good brand, and I know that she'll get great use out of it and love it for her job. And then, I got her some of these goodie ouchless bold holes. These were what I was trying to tell y'all about in that one Dollar Tree haul. Um, that, uh, those, uh, Dollar Tree hair things. They kind of reminded me of these, but not really. Obviously, these are a lot better. But yeah, uh, these will be great for her. She has a lot of hair. And then I got her. This is funny. This is actually from Dollar General. This right here. She needs a new wallet so bad. And um, she does not like for me to get like an expensive wallet or anything like that for her. So I did go ahead and get this one. Um, it's a zip up one. And I know she'll get great use out of it as well. I also got her one of these um, hand cream things because she has dry hands as well. So I got both her and my mom one. I'll just probably put this in their stocking. And then the last thing I got Maddie is um, this Hickory Farms sampler. And I got it because it has sweet hot mustard. 
I've never heard of Sweet Hot Mustard before. So I think she'll really like that. And it's a small one. I didn't want to get a huge one in case she doesn't like some of the stuff. It won't be completely wasted because y'all know I don't eat pork anymore. So this was at Walmart for $9.98. And we also went into the mall and they had a whole like kiosk thing set up of the Hickory Farms Company. And they had y'all so many different box sets and i mean huge ones too they had some this size as well i think they were charging way more for this size though at the actual hickory farms kiosk so i find it at walmart which is such a good deal y'all for ten dollars now they do have bigger ones at walmart i think they're like um twenty dollars but yeah i am i say that i'm done with maddie but i'll probably get her something else and then for my mom, like I said, I'm ordering that Fitbit tonight and I'm done with Maddie's grandma. I say that I'm done, y'all, but I'll probably come back with other stuff because I just, I don't know, I love shopping and I like getting stuff for people. That's just how I am during the holidays. So yeah, I'm excited about these books. I should have got myself one, but I'm not a big Pioneer Woman fan. I mean, I have nothing against her. I just don't watch enough of her to really be into it, you know? So that's why I didn't get myself one. I didn't even show y'all the price. Y'all probably saw it. $20.98. I gotta try and get this off though. Because this is a hardback. Like there's no paper to this. This is like all book. I need to try and scrape those purse tags off though. So yeah. Alright y'all. So my mom's Fitbit came in. I got her the Fitbit. In Fitbit. <laughs> the Fitbit. Fitbit. Why can't I say it? Fitbit Inspire HR fitness tracker and it has the heart rate monitor on there so you get oh you get this it's swim proof the 24 7 heart rate sleep track and smartphone notifications up to five days of battery life so it comes with a black band and a small band and a large band i am going to go online on ebay and get her um some different band colors she likes the color blue so i'm gonna get her blue then i'm gonna get her like white gray stuff like that that'll match outfits that she wears um maybe some like neutral colors y'all know what i'm saying so i got in my mom's last christmas gift so this will probably be the end of the gifts i um, have one more thing to get from maddie i'm probably going to get her some rechargeable batteries and like the charger and all that stuff that goes with it and this is the last thing that i was waiting for for my mom i'll take that back i'm probably going to get my mom some more fitbit bands but I have to go to Walmart to pick those up. So these will be the last thing as far as this video is concerned. I am gifting my mom the Strawberry Pound Cake Bath and Body Works candle. I was waiting for my Bath and Body Works order and it took forever. And I'm also gifting her the Black Cherry Merlot candle. They both smell amazing. I know she's really going to get a kick out of this Strawberry Pound Cake because it smells just like Strawberry Pound Cake. My mom is not a huge candle burner so she literally can make these two, two candles last for a long time. At least probably about eight months if not the whole year. Um, she loves the Bath and Body Works candles but she just doesn't burn them like that so i only picked up two for her then of course i got her the hand soaps well that is the video thank you all so much for watching i do just want to let you know that i hope you have a beautiful and blessed holiday a very merry christmas um definitely focus on the true meaning of christmas it's not about gifts and all this stuff this is nice for a video and it's nice to give people that you love things to make them smile but always understand the true meaning of christmas and cherishing your loved ones i hope that y'all have a great time with your families if you're not with family for whatever reason i hope that you just have a nice time with yourself take yourself out somewhere do something nice for yourself um, if all else fails, you can binge watch my videos because I have a ton of them on my channel. I will see you all here on my channel again on the 26th. And again, make sure you're staying tuned because I have giveaways coming up. I love you all so much. Merry Christmas again to you. Happy holidays. I'll talk to you again in my next video. Bye.